we're not here to generate sound bites about what we do. It's not, that's not our, our forte. You know, we're farmers and cheesemakers. We care for our, our land and our animals. Uh, and we strive for a high quality product. And to just put words to that is difficult because in today's day and age, those, those words have been hijacked by industrialized food systems and they don't mean anything anymore when applied to what we do. The real way to, to experience and to, to see what we do is to, to be here, to visit the area, to meet us, taste our products right out of our hand, right out of the farm store. We're farmers. Crafters. Hikers. We're stewards of this land. Climbers. Butchers. Paddlers. Producers. We grow local. Local veggies. Hops. We make. Make cheese. Beer. Whiskey. Wine. And we climb mountains. Hills. Hay bales. And tractors. We care about our community. We love this place. These rivers. These lakes. Valleys. We want to share. To share the bounty of this land. Our work. Our play. Good things made well. We came here with a goal of sort of returning to where I felt home and where I felt connected and starting a farm and finding land without exploring what type of market potential there was for that. But feeling with our generation and the time and seeing in other places a growing movement of desire and support for local food and an increase in small farms marketing directly to local consumers. And there's this explosion of a whole bunch of folks our age buying or leasing land. But since we all started in similar timing, we all had somewhat like of a shared experience or similar footing and we could meet each other and have shared experiences and talk about things and learn about each other's strengths and how we could help each other out or how we could collaborate and not just jump in and be butting heads and competing immediately, but figure out how to build up this new food economy within the Adirondacks. And it feels really good to encourage an expansion of your own values in a very positive and helpful way and not selling it or force feeding it or you know manipulating people with marketing it's just we have this really good product and it turns out you like it you get to come buy it